Hello, friends, and welcome to Little Bean's Garden, located in Pomona, California, Zone 10A, established in 2015. My name is Sule, and I will be your host for today. Today is October 1st, 2023, and today I will be planting my onion seeds. And these are seeds that I collected myself. Let me get them out of this bag. I let two onions go to seed, and that is the result of the two onions. And you couldn't see it through the bag, but um, most of them are still in their little casing. But let me see if I can find some where I can show you and they are outside of the little flower casing. Okay, so don't judge my hands. I've been working in the garden, but hopefully you can see that. This is the flowers dried up. These are ones that still have some seeds in there. And then these are the onion seeds. Aren't they looking pretty? Let me grab one so you can see it up close and personal. Where's the thing? Right here. It fell. How dare it. Okay, let me see if we can do that again. Okay, so here it is. That's the onion seed. They're looking really nice and healthy, honestly. I am so happy because they are. And I get to plant the onions from my own grown seeds. Or from my own seeds, I should say. Let me bring you up close. We'll do about two together. You know the drill. Okay, friends, we're going to do these two together and I am going to be adding two seeds, two seeds per little seed cell. Okay, so here's one. There's a drop. Here's the second one. Here's one and here's the second one. All right, so let's do the other one. And I'm doing the same thing. I will be doing two seeds. Here's the drop for one. And here's the drop for the second one. Here's one and here's the second one. All right, let me get the rest done and I will bring you right back. Friends, I'm not sure if you can see, but all seven of my rolls have two little seeds in them. There's some, let me see. Okay, there's some soil. Well, it's not soil. It's potting mix. There's some potting mix on top already of these little seed cells. So I'm just going to move that along and semi-cover it. But I'll come back a second time and add more potting mix so that they are fully, fully covered. Okay, so then we're adding more potting mix. And we're not adding a lot because we don't want to cover them too much and then they will sink to the bottom and then rot we don't want that so we're just gonna be adding a little bit more on top just enough that the seeds are covered completely and that's all there is to it friends that's it that's all we're going to do to them and for this tray i am not going to top water it i am going to bottom water it later which means i will add the water here that will be wicked up through the little holes you see there at the bottom and maintaining the seeds and the potting soil moist so that they can grow and produce for me all right the last thing we're going to do is put our plant label you think you're going to remember and you don't oops i'm missing the s right there hold on okay here we go it's all fixed and i am going to put that here at the beginning of our sea tray okay all right so once they come up i will show you how they're doing once they have sprouted all right see you later today is october 11 2023 and this is how the early texas grano onion is doing and if you remember these are from seeds that i harvested in my garden so they are my own harvested seeds from my garden my environment my city 
and my growing zone and they are doing absolutely fabulous they look amazingly healthy and just check this out they're just so beautiful and they're small but they're beautiful well guys that's it from little beans garden if you like this video please consider subscribing hitting the like button and sharing this video with your friends we'll see you on the next one take care